the Indonesian Anoa armored personnel carrier was developed by Pindad. Its development commenced in 2004. This APC is named after an Indonesian type of buffalo. It is also referred as the APS-3. First prototype of this armored vehicle was revealed in 2006. It resembles the French VAB 6x6. Production commenced in 2008. A total of 150 of these APCs are planned to be produced for the Indonesian Army. Some countries showed their interest in purchasing the ANOA. Some sources claim that Oman ordered 200 of these APCs. Armored hull of the ANOA provides all-round protection against 7.62mm armor-piercing rounds. Hull floor withstands a 8kg anti-tank mine blast. In combat order front windscreens are covered with armored shutters for increased protection. The baseline Pindad Anoa armored personnel carrier is fitted with a shielded cupola, which mounts a 12.7mm machine gun or 40mm automatic grenade launcher. This cupola is capable of 360 degrees rotation. This APC has a crew of three, including commander, gunner and driver. It accommodates up to 10 fully equipped infantrymen. Commander and driver enter and leave the vehicle via the side doors, while the troops dismount via the rear doors or roof hatches. There are numerous firing ports with associated vision blocks, provided for the occupants. The Anoa 6x6 APC uses Renault engine and transmission, however indigenous options are being developed as a replacement. Engine is located at the front of the hull, behind the driver. Vehicle is powered by Renault MIDR 0620 for 5 turbocharged diesel developing 320 horsepower. The Anoa has a central tire inflation system. This APC is not amphibious. Variants. Fire support vehicle. Its prototype, armed with a CMI Defense CSE, 90 turret with the Cockerell 90mm gun was revealed in 2008. This fire support vehicle is planned to be operational with the Indonesian Army by 2010. Armored ambulance. Command vehicle. Armored Logistics Vehicle Armored Recovery Vehicle Reconnaissance Vehicle Mortar Carrier A 4x4 variant of this APC has been developed. This variant is fully amphibious.